everybody. We're at Cadillac Lanes in Waterloo, Iowa. And I work here. But I wanted to show this arcade machine. Uh, not everybody really cares. It's just a golf arcade machine. But I thought it would be kind of neat. Uh, 2014 Golden Tee Live. And what I thought was cool is not everybody gets to see the uh, boot up sequence for this. So let's go ahead and flip these on. Uh, uh, the back row uh, noises from another machine. The top screen I just showed you is upside down, but it actually uses Linux uh, to boot up. <clears throat> Might take a while, but uh, for you that are still interested in what's going on, just keep on watching. I'm recording the whole thing. <laughs> More background music from other games. There we go. It's getting closer. As you can see, it uses Linux. So it's booting from hard drive. There we go. So, in theory, it's actually using a, an actual computer inside. It uses NVIDIA graphics card, a hard drive to store the game. And <clears throat> there we go. Pretty much done. I just thought I would show you that portion with the Linux booting up in the back. I've never actually seen that and thought that was kind of neat. So this is a 2014 Gold T Live uh, arcade machine here in Cadillac Lanes of Waterloo, Iowa. And I guess certain companies use Linux for their operating system. Uh, there is another arcade machine I probably won't show because I don't... I'm not a big fan of shooting games, even if you're just shooting zombies. But uh, uh, House of the Dead 4 by Sega seems to also use Linux of some form, because you can see it boot, booting in the background. So, but okay, well, just thought I'd show you that. Almost takes a whole five minutes to boot this up. <laughs>